let's see. Hey, Hoyans, it is Sunday, the 16th of September, and I'm fixing to do a plan with me. Um, I usually do it on Sunday. That's like my restart my week. I consider Sunday the first part of the week. That's, that, that's my reset day. Um, I'll do my planner. Uh, we have church. Um, I got to go visit my mother. So, but it's going to be good. It's going to be good. So, we're fixing to do a plan with me. And, uh, yeah, yeah. And I'm even going to try to do my menu yesterday. And I did not do a grocery haul. But I'll probably do that um, tomorrow. Like I said, we took this week's grocery budget. And instead of doing a Walmart pickup order um, while we were in Prattville yesterday, we just went on to Millbrook, which is another little town like right there. And um, we did our meat stock up. We didn't find like the half price deals that we did like in July. But we got enough, I think, to last us at least a month. Um, well, I know we did. I know we got us enough to last us at least a month. Usually we get enough for that same amount of money to last two months. But we didn't find the, the clearance deals like we usually do. So, we might have to do another um, time next month where we don't buy groceries. We just debate to meet. But all that being said, let's get to the plan with me for the week. Alright, what I'm going to do first, I'm going to turn y'all this way and kind of point you down. Let's see how we are. We're going to kind of zing in a little bit <coughs> oh, excuse me um I'm just gonna got, go ahead and turn to this week anything that I need to make note of I will put on a post-it note and I will put like that um, instead of actually doing it in ink I'm just going to do it on a post-it note. I know I've got physical therapy Tuesday and Thursday, but I cannot... Uh-oh, my bracelet got hung. I cannot, for the life of me, remember what time. So, I'm going to look back. Oh, and if you saw my... Um, oh, goodness, my video about the corner pockets. They are sticking fine to paper. And... So far, it's kind of hanging in there on the uh, dashboard, but I have had to catch myself kind of really pushing it down. So I think they're kind of the corner pockets are geared more for, and it is the Erin Condren product. You do order them from Erin Condren, and I think 20 came in a pack. Um, and they're great for like sticking for like one or two things. Um, like an appointment card or something, but um, you can't cram too much in there, and I found it sticks best to paper. So, but the way I'll plan my week is I'll go ahead and I'll look, where's September, here we go, I'll look at my week, and I have yet to use this, I need to, I need to utilize this. But we are at the week of the 17th, and I know I've got physical therapy this day. I just don't know what time. So I'm just going to kind of write that in. And I know on Thursday... It's just a standing of, um, it's at one. Okay. So, um, 
So I'm going to fill in my week. And I found over here what I'm going to do with these little spots. Let's see if I can get y'all. Ah, they're all over the place. Um, I'm going to do my YouTube videos. Like what I edit and upload. And then what I'm going to video. And I think that's what I'm going to do with these spots. Since I've got my dashboard that will clip in for my menus. Um, my what's to eat. Instead of doing my menus in these squares, I'm going to do my YouTube videos. And that way it will help me keep up with um, what I need to video, any ideas that come to my head, have I uploaded a certain video. So, I'm going to fill in my week and then I'm going to check back in with you and let you see what it looks like. How my week has shaped up. Let's see if I can get y'all out of Zoom. <laughs> um, I'm gonna just take my little post-it note. Like I said, instead of writing down a call I need to make, I'm just gonna stick it on a posty. Um, Monday, I need to remember to mail out the planners to the winners. So basic lemon and um, oh. Oh, sweet heavens. I know her name. Lozzie. Lozzie. <laughs> oh, I knew that. Um, our library books are due, so we'll just do that whenever before we get ready to go to ARC, because it's the library is just right down the street from ARC, um, the one that we like. So, we'll do that. Uh, I am going to make it a priority to work out, and I'm going to... Today is a new beginning. I just kind of put that there for this week to remind myself I'm starting this week. It's a, it's a new week. Even though I screwed up and didn't do it last week, it's a new week. So I'm going to work out. Monday I'm going to do Sweating to the Oldies. Um, Tuesday I do have physical therapy, but I'm going to try to figure out how to do Zumba. We've got Roku, and so I can look up Zumba workouts. I think I can kind of, sort of, do a version of Zumba. I don't know. I would never take an actual class in Zumba. Um, 
they would go one way, I would go the other. I am left-handed, technically. I write, I write with my left hand. Everything else I do with my right hand, so I'm ambidextrous. Yeah, I'm special, aren't I? Mm. I had to get water. Um, Wednesday, we're going to go to the Y, so I'll do my swim class there. Um, we're going to grab a healthy lunch after the Y because baby girl has a 1 o'clock recheck from her blood work she had last week. So, um, even if we don't do anything but run to Sam's, and grab a salad. We can run to Sam's and grab a salad. Um, they have the best berry and chicken salad. It is wonderful and it's very inexpensive. So I think we'll do that. Of course, if I give Kevin Beth the option, she'll pick something like pizza or a hot dog, but she needs to eat healthy. Um, Thursday, I've got my gamma treatment. It runs between 7.30 to noon. I'll be there for that. I usually sleep, so that's kind of like a good rest, relaxation time. I tease them all the time. They need to have somebody that will come through and do many petties. They would make a killing. Uh, <laughs> I'll have physical therapy. I know it's at 1. So between, and it's just right down the street from where I get my gamma treatment. So uh, I'll either pack me a sack lunch, which is what I usually do, or um, I might run to uh, Shashi's and get me some chicken and dumplings. They had the best chicken and dumplings. Um, it just depends on how hot and cold it is. Friday, I don't have anything. Woohoo! So far. We might go to the Y. We might go to the Y. I need to make it. Oh, I didn't put it in. Oh, yeah. The Y will count as my exercise. So I'm going to put a star next to it because that will count as my exercise Thursday I will not exercise because I've got to be at my gamma treatment so eat early and I will have physical therapy and when I get home I will just sleep um, if I do too much after my gamma treatment and sometimes even doing the physical therapy is kind of pushing it um, I will get a gamma headache and so that is not good it's to the point that you can't even blink and it hurts. Um, yeah, it gets that bad. So, but Friday I should be good. Um, we are going to put uh, either the Y. I think we'll do the Y. I think we'll do the Y. Y, swim, and then Carol Beth cardio. And that's at nine. So that will be our that will be our exercise for that day. Um, I did my be productive. Um, Saturday I got to clean my house thoroughly. Uh, I got to prepare for Ladies' Day. Um, I'm gonna order the pizzas. Sunday afternoon we at two o'clock. I'm hosting a ladies' wreath making party. A friend of ours. Um, is going to come and teach the ladies how to make the burlap wreaths. So, and I just did a Choose Joy sticker, um, my happy, mom life is best life. I just kind of filled in with some things. But my be productive. The best way, if you really, and I've said this before, if you really want to clean your house, like really clean your house, invite people over. Host something. Um, in December, we always do a pie party, and we had the most fun. Everybody brings a pie, uh, whatever kind they want, and we have a contest, um, and you can bring a store-bought pie. Um, the homemade pies go on one table, the store-bought pies go on another. Um, we used to have, like, a judging, but it was so hard for the judges. Bless their hearts. <coughs> Excuse me. They didn't get to mingle and fellowship and just have a good time talking with everybody. 
And we just all enjoy talking with one another and having fellowship. And just, we eat pie. We supplied the plates, the cups, the drinks, which usually it's just water and um, eggnog or water. And um, I think last year we did tea. Yeah, I think last year we did tea. Um, and then coffee. Um, but it's just so much fun. Easiest party you could ever throw. Seriously. But last year what we did, instead of having the judges, we just numbered all the pies. Um, we numbered all the homemade pies, and then we numbered all the store-bought pies. The homemade pie winner got an apron and a pie plate. That Yeah, a uh, Pioneer Woman pie pan. Yeah. And then the store-bought winner got a Publix gift card, because that's the best they could do. And so, well, we just had fun. But it gave me the incentive to get my house clean. And pie party is always the first Saturday in December. Unless it's SCC championship game. And then it's the second Saturday in December. Or the first Sunday in December. Um, yeah. It just depends on how that SCC game goes, y'all. We schedule things around football here in the South. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Our wedding was at 1030 in the morning on a Saturday because that was like the first Saturday of football. So we had to schedule it around that Alabama game. I kid you not. Yeah. Um, <laughs> anywho, that's how my week shaped out. Um, I have not gotten to my menu plan yet. I've got to take into, I'm going to take into consideration the things that I've got in my freezer. I also need to plan out. Ooh, man. I'm going to sit y'all down. My hands starting to get a cramp. There. I think that'll work. Um, let's angle y'all. That way, maybe. I can't tell. I can never tell with this thing. Um, but I'm going to kind of go through my freezer. I know what I bought yesterday. Like I said, I'll make a separate video of that, of the the meat that we bought um but yeah that is how my plan with me we shaped up um and then as things come along i'll fill them in um but yeah that is my plan with me for this week like i said short of my menu plan and i'll probably i was gonna say i'll probably get to my um freezer i might yeah I'll have to do it later this afternoon. Yeah. Yeah, I'll do that later this afternoon. Um, we have got that pork butt that I did yesterday. We've got that in there. We're going to have that today for lunch. And uh, baked beans and coleslaw. And leftover waffle fries from the other night. And that's going to be lunch. And then me and my husband are going to go see my mother. And she's in the, um, like, the the rehab part of the nursing home um, until she can move back move in with my sister God bless her oh y'all pray for my sister she is a saint that woman's going to earn many a jewel in her crown um, but that's how my week shaping up and uh, yeah I got to sit down and figure out what videos I'm going to plan this week. I know I'm going to do a Zoo Lily. And then I got to do a menu plan and pantry plan out type thing. Um, so those are two. Um, if you'd like to see anything, comment down below. Um, any videos that you would like to see. Um, also, if you have not, hit that red subscribe button. And that way... Um, you will be part of our family here um, at Laundry Mom. And if you haven't heard the story behind that one, um, I got that nickname because my middle name is Lynn. And I would always tease my husband, the L stood for laundry. Because I could die five years from now or 50 years from now. It's going to be in front of that washer and dryer. I can go ahead and tell you. If I was to go to a fortune teller or whatever, 
I don't believe in them things. I'm sorry. If they were that good, they would have done one lottery and they wouldn't be doing palm reading out of double wides. I'm just saying. Okay? Have you ever noticed all them people are out of, out of trailers? Now, I'm sorry. If you're that good of a, a fortune teller, you'd be done had your fortune and you wouldn't be in a, a double wide. And I'm not knocking double wides. I lived in one for... 15 years. Hey, it was an upgrade from the single wide we had. We moved on up. Um, yeah. <clears throat> I used to always say if we won the lottery, I'd go and buy the biggest triple wide they'd made. See, I didn't think outside the box and think of a mansion. I just wanted the biggest tri triple wide. Yeah. But, um, but yeah, if you hadn't hit that red subscribe button, do it that way you'll see the crazy see I don't even know why that I had actually started talking to him. oh we were playing in weren't we that's just how all this works y'all I yeah I see a neurologist I see a therapist yeah so but remember Put on those pearls, put on that smile, and y'all be sweet. Okay, also to go along with my plan with me, I went ahead and I just thought about it in my mind. I, I knew I had Monday through Wednesday planned out as far as my meals. So I just went ahead and did Thursday through Sunday because uh, Sunday was easy. I knew I needed pizza for my ladies. So this is how our menu plan shaped out. Oh, let me see if I can get it out of here. I'm loving my little clip it clip in thing. <laughs> Alright, so Monday is going ooh, glare. Monday is going to be the Stouffer's Mexican enchilada dish that I got. If y'all have never tried that, oh my stars. You gotta give it a whirl. Um, I like the um, the party size because it's got the rice up underneath. So it's the Stouffer's Chicken Enchiladas um, party size. And it's only like 12 bucks. So, and it is wonderful. And the only thing I'll have to do with that is I've got those chips and salsa and then the cheese dip. Cheese dip, I've got a meatloaf in my freezer. And then I've got instant mashed taters and green beans. Wednesday, I've got a pork tenderloin in there I need to use. Some canned sweet taters, um, squash in my freezer, and then some zipper peas that I found in the freezer. Thursday will either be leftovers, which we might have some leftovers. I don't know. Or I've got some emergency pizzas in the freezer. Friday night will be fish. I've got some fish sticks for the girls. I've got some tilapia for uh, whoever wants tilapia. And then I've got some shrimp down in there. I'm going to do some shrimp creole over rice and then broccoli. I'm going to steam. And then Saturday night, we're going to do steak. We got some steak yesterday at the feed outlet. And then canned taters and the vegetables I'm just going to do on the sheet pan. And um, I know it says steam, but I'm going to bake them. I need to change that. And then Sunday, my ladies will be here. We're going to have pizza. I was just going to order um, the Little Caesars um, $5 pizzas. I think they're still $5 if you get the pepperoni and the cheese. So that's what I was going to do for that. So, and then I just told everybody, bring their own beverage. Like, whether they want soda or water or I'll have waters uh, we always have water um yeah so that is our menu for this week I'm going to get this clip back in my planner and uh we won't need anything from the store I've got bread in the freezer if anything we might have to pick up a gallon of milk um, I do have, never have made baby girls muffins. Um, we did do uh, those cinnamon rolls we had for the breakfast this morning. I made one can. So I still got a can of those left. We've got a ton of lunch stuff. Um, 
yeah yeah we'll be able to, to manage and get by for sure without um like i said the only thing i might need to buy is milk and then um saturday i'll just call little caesars and order those pizzas for sunday and um i'll have brian or becca on their way home from church they go to church in montgomery and um uh, had them just swing by and pick up my pizzas for me. So, because Brian's like right across the street from Little Caesars. I'm so sorry, y'all. Oh, it has been awful. All right, but that's how our menu shaped up to be. So, not bad for, I would say shelf timber, but we've been buying some things so but until next time until next video bye y'all